Today we're going to be completing the whole entire season pass so you guys can see if it's even worth it or not and pretty much everything you get out of it. So if you guys do end up enjoying this video then make sure to smash the like button and click the subscribe button as well to support the channel because I would greatly appreciate it so thank you if you do. Also if you really enjoy pet catchers, trading, entering giveaways and just overall want to be a part of my wonderful community then make sure to join my discord server by clicking the link in the description down below. Now one more thing before we get into this video you guys know what time it is it is giveaway time. So I'm going to be giving away another tier one secret pet which is called the sunset star which is the brand new tier one in this update so if you want a chance to win it all you got to do is like the video subscribe to the channel and comment your roblox username in the comment section down below best of luck to you guys i hope you win now enough yapping let's get into the video so you're probably thinking elcon there is no way you grinded through this pass already it just released nope i didn't actually grind through it we are going to be skipping it today with robux yes i'm going to be using robux to skip this whole entire pass so you guys can actually see if it's worth grinding grinding or not now i'm pretty sure everyone knows what's at the end of the pass but either way we're gonna get into it we're gonna skip it and we're also going to open the eggs in it as well and see if we can get something good so let's go ahead and get into it so here is the season pass we already completed two tiers so far we're just gonna skip it and uh, unlock everything so there we go we went ahead and completed the whole entire pass it takes 150,000 medals to complete the whole entire season one pass so as you can see all these goody rewards in here and then we got completely to the end so there's only 20 tiers which i wish they added more but it's all right we have 20 tiers to grind out so the first half of the pass we got is we got 750 gems we got two eggs which i already claimed five respawn tomes we got some egg elixir we got some mystery scrolls we got more eggs prismatic sunday legendary cube fatal strike ruin some more eggs we got some cherries we got some more eggs we got some jelly we got an efficiency ruin we got some more eggs prismatic elixir a lot more eggs oh my goodness prismatic egg and then the magma booth i think it's called or something like that i don't know it looks like a magma booth but either way that is the top row so let's go down to the bottom if you guys didn't know you actually have to pay robux for the bottom half as well now i'm not really sure on how the bottom half actually works I wonder if you purchase this the first time and then you reset it and if you're able to still have premium or do you have to pay for it again? Well, either way, I'm going to buy premium. So let's go and do that. So there we go. The season one premium has been bought. I can now collect the bottom row. So we got more eggs. We got some elixir, some more eggs. Oh my goodness. You do get a lot of eggs. Some more elixir, prismatic Sunday, cherries, more eggs, void cherry. We got a critical ruin. We got a prismatic egg, which is pretty nice. Prismatic elixir, some more eggs, prismatic paint, more eggs. We got prismatic tome, respawn tome homes eggs 15,000 gems. We got another prismatic egg. And then the last and final one, which is the booth customization, which I'm not sure what that is, but it looks like some type of stars or something. We will check these out as well. I'll go to the trading plaza and customize it. But either way, we got a bunch of rewards from this. Now, would I say it's personally worth it to skip through the pass? Yeah, honestly, I would because you do have a chance at limited secret pets that are going to be gone in 19 days and you can only get them from these eggs. And you can also reset this pass up to five times with gems and then infinitely after that with robots. So it's pretty good overall, so I would definitely say the pass is worth it. So we're now going to go to the trading plaza and check out these booth customizations and see if they look cool or not. So there we go. We are now inside the trading plaza. Let's go ahead and head on over to a booth and, well, check out these customizations. So here we go. We're going to claim a booth. There we go. Customization. And then here is the magma booth. So let's check out this. So earned by completing the free track in season one. Oh, it's actually called the magma skin. Okay, so we equipped it. Let's see what it looks like. And oh my goodness, that actually looks really clean. So this is the free version. It doesn't look like the picture sure um fits on the booth itself which looks a little awkward does that look like that on every single booth oh so it hangs off on every booth okay that definitely needs rework that looks weird but okay either way this is what the magma skin looks like let's go ahead and customize here and check out the last one so the last one we got is the cosmo skin and this is the premium version equipped and well this is what it looks like this actually looks pretty clean as well would i say this is worth the skipping no not really but either way it's a pretty nice skin overall that's what the two skins look like at the end of the pass now that we got that out of the way, let's get into opening these eggs and see if we can get one of the brand new secret pets. So if you guys want to know how many eggs you get in total from the pass, whether it's the free version and or the premium version as well, you get a total of 60 series one eggs. So I'm pretty sure you get probably like 30 in the top row and then 30 in the bottom row, somewhere around there. But I definitely could be wrong. But either way, you get a total of 60. So let's go ahead and pull them out. And wow, wow, wait, 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 you can actually hatch these six at a time. I thought you could only hatch them one at a time. Oh, well, then we're going to go through these. No problem. Now, I'm pretty sure using boost does 
change the odds of these eggs because they're like normal eggs as well so definitely make sure to use your boost if it doesn't make sure to let me know in the comment section down below but i'm pretty sure it definitely does increase the odds let's go ahead and pull them out we got a solid six eggs and well see if we can hatch anything come on so before we hatch these eggs real quick the new secrets are one in 931 and one in 9300 with ultra lucky boost super lucky boost and the normal lucky boost as well now that we got that out of the way let's get into hatching and see if we can get anything so the first set of six eggs can we get anything good we got a legendary already what's it gonna be and whoa wait a minute are these all the same pet i don't really care about the stats of the pet but maybe some of you guys do so i'll go and turn off auto delete real quick okay so there we go i turned it off let's get back into hatching here and then we'll check out the pet as well we got this weird angle maybe we'll get a secret we got a legendary and okay just a normal legendary so this is the midnight firefly let's go ahead and pull it out real quick and see what it looks like so this is what the midnight firefly looks like and this is the base stats of the midnight firefly so we got 500 damage 175 coins and 225 tokens not bad at all especially if you're a new player and get a hold of these eggs um definitely would help an alt account as well but either way let's get back into hatching these eggs oh my goodness we keep getting this weird angle there's two legendaries and nothing good unfortunately that's a legendary and doesn't even show the actual colors okay can we stop getting this angle please Do it for the video. Do it for the video. Ah, uh, we ended up getting only legendaries, unfortunately. Nothing great out of all 60 of those eggs. But uh, yeah, hopefully we can get one maybe in the future. Also, if any of you guys have those secret pets out there, please let me know in the comment section down below. I would love to showcase them and show off the stats. So if you have the last tier secret and the first tier, please let me know and hit me up. And I would definitely be down to showcase it for you. But that's everything about the brand new season pass. I really do enjoy it, but I'm gonna let you guys be the judge of that. So do you guys think it's worth it or is it not even close to worth it? Let me know in the comment section down below. I would love to hear your guys' opinion. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully you found it helpful if you guys have any questions regarding this video and or pet catchers in general then also let me know in the comment section down below but without further ado this is then the video so make sure to smash the like button click the subscribe button and click the notification bell to never miss an upload thank you guys again for watching and i'll catch you guys all in the next video peace out everybody